We're here at Cirque du Spray, the Blueberry Art Project. The entire project is about painting out poverty in a red zone district in Florida. And what we have is 17 graffiti artists that will be working all around the building, getting us ready for um, our New Year's Eve celebration, which is Cirque du Spray. And that is a Russian uh, themed circus. And the idea is to paint out poverty. This Blueberry Arts project is just an outcropping of the original project that started out to help get um, kids off the street, teach them uh, real art techniques and give them a canvas, in other words, for their overall talent that they have that needs to be nurtured. It just really is uh, very impressive what's going on here. You know, it, it really helps a community like this to have a, a, an art thing like this going on. It's, it's good for everybody. And uh, I've been walking around and looking at all the uh, things that are on display right now. And I understand their works in progress, but they are very, very impressive. This is, this is fabulous. We have artists from all over the United States coming. From as far away as New York, we have um, artists coming in from Miami. Um, by the time this is all over, we'll have people representing various parts of the United States all over this building. The purpose of this project initially was only to build EVAC, the Eloise Visual Arts Center, a life skills and visual arts park for teens and young adults. So after this project is finished and we've made a statement to the rest of the community about how important art is to change and, and prosperity, we're going to move forward in building EVAC. Blueberry Packing House, which we're doing as a, as a theme. So uh, my uh, my slogan here is uh, change is up to you. And I chose this theme because of what um, the Blueberry Project stands for. And uh, it's about changing and revitalizing, revitalizing this area and bring, uh, uh, bring the message that the area we're in is, uh, is, is poverty. The overall effort is to bring change to Eloise and this particular CRA, this particular area. Hopefully it'll become a, an arts enclave and a destination for artists. I live about three miles from here in a, in a little different neighborhood and it's completely different on this side. Um, so uh, Jane Waters and the uh, um, Arts Ensemble um, invited me to come out and uh, put some artwork on the walls and it's been a while since I've done uh, graffiti. This is a big, really big part here of the community revitalization that's going on right here in the Eloise community. And uh, I, I think it's just going to be a great, great thing. <laughs>